This question was asked in the Gate Physics paper 2020. This is a MCQ type question having one mark. This question is from the topic quantum statistics. The question is choose the correct statement related to the Fermi energy EF and the chemical potential mu of a metal. Option A is mu equals to EF only at 0 Kelvin. Option B mu equals to EF at finite temperature. Option C mu less than EF at 0 Kelvin. And the last option, option D, mu greater than EF at finite temperature. Let us see how to solve this problem. We know the Fermi distribution function in discrete form is given by the average number or the occupation number of the particles at the energy level Ea is 1 by 1 plus exponential of Ea minus mu by kBT, where mu is the chemical potential. Now, if we want to see the plot of this function, uh, then we will get two nature of this function uh, that is at t equals to 0, it will be a step function. So, this will this function will have value 1 uh, less than the energy Ef equals to mu and at t greater than 0 Kelvin, it will be a decreasing function like this and at uh, mu, it will have 50 percent occupation probability that, that is it, it will have a value half. Now let us choose a temperature very close to 0 Kelvin. So at this temperature, this exponential term that is exponential of Ea minus mu by kBT will tend to infinity plus infinity if our energy Ea is greater than mu. And this exponential term will be very small positive value close to 0 if our energy level is less than our chemical potential mu. So the average number of the particle that is the occupation number will be 1 if Ea is less than mu and it will be 0 if Ea is greater than mu when the temperature is very close to 0 Kelvin. So from here we can conclude that we get that at t equals to 0 Kelvin that is absolute 0 the Fermi energy level is equal to chemical potential energy that is Ef equals to mu at t is equal to 0 Kelvin. So our option A is correct in this case. So for this question uh, the first option option A that is mu equals to EF only at 0 Kelvin is the correct option.